everybody and welcome to Hammerdown Motorsports and today we are introducing to the channel another one of my cars so let's go check it out. Well everybody, this is my 1972 Dodge Dart and uh, yeah, I've been waiting all winter to have this thing out and go have some fun with it, so let's go do just that. Alright, we made it to Westy's shop with the 72 Dart and uh, what we're going to be doing today is putting a new starter in this car because when I bought this car, this car was built about 10 years before I purchased it. And uh, when you have long tube headers and a starter, they don't like to live in the same place for very long because the heat from the headers ends up kind of deteriorating the windings in the starter. And uh, when this car gets hot, it does not want to restart. It turns over super slow, like you got a dead battery or something like that. But uh, definitely is just the uh, starter is past its due it needs to be replaced so we're going to be doing that today and uh, also I'm probably gonna to have to look at my temperature gauge because it seems to read like way higher than it should and when I open the hood I mean it's not even that hot in here everything uh, I can touch it with my hands so obviously if I can do that it's not too bad but we're gonna to try to figure out a couple of these issues and uh, we'll be on the road <music> Well, this is where we got to get the starter out from, and uh, they leave you next to no room, so this will be fun. All right, since we are at Westy's shop anyway, I do have the starter put in now, which was a bit of a problem with the uh, steering and stuff being in the way, but got it all taken apart, put back together and tested. It is ready to go. But we are going to set the timing on this engine so we don't have any more issues with it not wanting to start when it's hot and things like that. I never ever had this thing timed, so it's probably about time to do it anyway. And uh, being that we're right across the parking lot from Diablo Formula Racing, we're going to check out Mike's Street Speed 717's new mods to his Corvette, which they will be starting the car up very soon. And we'll share that with everybody out there. as always we're working into the night and uh, we're gonna leave the dart here because we're gonna order some new stuff for the valve train and get that all sorted out and get it ready to roll again speaking of getting ready to roll looks like Mike's car is uh, ready to do the same Well, this brings us to Tuesday, and I just talked to Westy, and the 72 Dodge Dart is all tuned up. The valves are set. The carb's adjusted. He took it for a rip. He said it sounds awesome. So we're going to go down there and pick it up. All right, we're here at 
Westy shop. Finally got the uh, dart running properly. We're gonna go take it for a little burn. Test run went awesome. This car runs totally different than it did when I brought it in. It is totally tight and everything is running as it should. So definitely check out Westy Speed Shop if you want anything done to your vehicle. All this information will be in the description. So it's time to take this thing home. Now I'm going to answer the question that I get asked the most and that's Steve you're a big Mopar guy why didn't you buy a Challenger and the answer is pretty simple to that question sports car muscle car that's all I got to say about that Well, that ends our video today, so I hope everybody enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. We have many more exciting things to come here on Hammerdown Motorsports. Keep that hammer down.